Thank you, Chris. Thank you, Pat. Thank you, everybody. Yeah, I'm the guy who got hit in the head with a baseball bat. Twice. <laughs> Yeah, pretty sweet, huh? It's not so bad, though. You know, it keeps random strangers from striking up a conversation with me. They see me walking through Fred Meyer, they don't know. I could be a maniac. I could be deranged. I could be dangerous. They just don't know. Like, all I have to do is put on a suit, and I'm a villain in the next James Bond movie. That's it. I don't need any makeup or anything. Just a button-up shirt with no collar. And a cat. <laughs> Good to go. <laughs> One thing is for sure with all of this, though, uh, my wife can never use the I have a headache excuse. <laughs> ever, ever again. <laughs> uh, I like to consider myself a tough guy, though. I think I've handled this pretty well. I grew up in a rough part of Seattle. And a lot of people don't think of Seattle as having rough neighborhoods. And the main reason that is, is they just sound nice. Like imagine you're a tourist, or maybe you're watching this right now and you've never been to Seattle, and you're looking at a map, and you're like, oh, where should we go today? Oh, it's Rainier Beach, that sounds nice. We could go for a walk and have a picnic and build some sandcastles. And your car probably won't be there when you get back. <laughs> oh, well, then we can head right up the hill to Skyway. Doesn't that sound like fun? Oh, I bet they have beautiful views in the skyways. So high up here, it really is like we're in the clouds. Uh, that's actually gun smoke. <laughs> See, they're laughing because they've been there before. <laughs> I can be your tour guide. One of the things I learned while I was growing up in the hood was uh, to rap. I learned how to rap, and uh, I love it. I've been doing it since I was a teenager. I've uh, grown now, though. I have kids, and so my only opportunity I get to rap is for them at bedtime. They love it, though. My daughter, she'll get really into it. She likes to pick random stuff out and have me do a song about it. She's like, all right, Daddy, this is going to be a tough one. Do a song about the wall. All right. One waltz, two waltz, three waltz, four. They all come together and meet at the door. They're painted pink and they're painted white. They keep us safe all through the night. Sucker, sleep tight. <laughs> Sweet dreams, baby. <laughs> How you guys doing? Hi, everybody. That's my crowd back there. Yeah. Now, I grew up in a very diverse neighborhood. Uh, there's nothing that bothers me more than racism. There's just so many better reasons to hate somebody <laughs> than the color of their skin. <laughs> I hate somebody because they're a pedophile. <laughs> hate somebody because they're a terrorist. Hate somebody because they work at Comcast. Like, these <laughs> are all awful people who deserve to die. Thank you.